My name is Verdi Alfaramendi and I was born in July 2011. I go to Pand Elementary School in Iran. We enjoy this competition so much and we hope that this competition helps us to be one step closer to our goals. Hello, I hope everyone is well. I am Suru Shakiba and I was born in Tehran on December 2010. I go to Pan Elementary School. This is my first time participating in this competition. Robotics is a passion that I really enjoy. I also learn how to work with Python and Scratch. The name of our group is CS Warriors. Our team reference number is TJI22IR4016. Just in case, and for the offline world, this is us. Like so many other kids, we were so curious about almost everything happening around us. Soon as a Generation Z, we started to learn some basics about coding and programming. We learned how to work hard for our achievements, so we named our group CS Warriors. Robocop Asia Pacific RCAP Few weeks back, we decided to participate in RoboCup Asia Pacific RCAP 2022 competitions. This is our first international experience in this field. Executive summary of preliminary challenge. This year's challenge is to program a virtual robot to collect colored objects in the virtual environment and place them in the deposit area and avoid traps. Our primary strategy was collect two objects from each color to get RRGGBB or two sets. Use the marker to find the deposit area. Soon we learn that something is wrong with our robot strategy and with its settings. We change settings to find more objects, but the figures were not satisfying at all. Then we decided to rethink and revise our strategy. Let's be! For the first four minutes, find as much as color objects, between three to six objects. All the time avoid traps. All the time go to the deposit zones. For the last one minute, Collect the minimum of one color object and go to deposit zones. New ideas for some new maps. Using markers in order to gain more scores. Follow the walls if deposit zones are next to walls to find them fast and easily. The new strategy. After all, we got more scores in the 5 minutes deadline. Our score increased from about 900 to 1,700 and more. Hello, in this video, I'm talking about Cosmos Rescue Robot Programming. The main purpose of this short video is about how a robot finds the deposit zones and transfer collected color objects. In the statements orange left condition tab loaded object section, we entered three as minimum and kept six as maximum. maximum. Then in the time section, we kept zero as the minimum and changed the maximum to 214. For real speed in the action tab, we changed the right wheel speed to 40 and kept 0 for the 
the left wheel. We had the same setting for the orange right, with just one logical change. We considered 14 for left wheel speed and 0 for the right wheel. In orange right and left statement, in the action tab, we changed the key action to deposit 1, change the duration to 3 seconds, and set value to for LED status. For orange left 2, in the condition tab in the time section, we entered 241 as the minimum and uh, 616 as the maximum and in the loaded objects we entered 1 for minimum and kept 6 as maximum. In the action tab we changed wheel right to 14 and 0 for wheel left. For orange right 2 the same setting as orange left 2. There is only one tiny change. We reset wheel left to 40 and kept 0 for wheel right. Orange left and right 2. Time and loaded object have the exact same setting as mentioned in the orange left 2 and orange right 2. Figures in the action tab also are the same as orange right and left. Thank you. Well, as you can see, this is our program, and you can see the overall performance of our robot. The robot is collecting a black object. He is going to a special area, and he is collecting another black object. He is depositing and he and he is collecting a cyan object. He is collecting another cyan object and he is collecting another cyan object. He is going to special area. He collected black object and a red object and another red object if he deposit he will get 220 scores and he is depositing so he deposit and he is collecting a cyan object. And that's it. Machine learning and artificial intelligence have become very important today. We see many examples of the application of artificial intelligence in our daily life. Best example of AI software used in our every Day life include voice assistants and image recognition for face unlock in mobile phones. During the pandemic, once again, we all learned the importance of on-time medical help. As we learned, we can program the robot like the virtual robot in CoSpace. We learned from these robots to deposit perfectly. We need more efficient robots for any potential future similar disasters to save more lives without putting other lives in danger. 3 billion animals harmed by Australia's fire. By designing efficient rescue robots, we can avoid making it happen again. We would like to thank our educators and teachers for their support, as well as the RCAP team for developing robotics. Thank you for your attention and goodbye.